Welcome to this short clip on how to spot the Thames seals in Richmond, Twickenham and Teddington. There's a large grey seal, an adult that's been seen in Richmond areas at Richmond Lock. It's been seen in Twickenham delighting some paddle boarders and it's also been seen in Teddington. Here he is uh, relaxing outside of the water on some of the rollers that are out there. So what will you actually see? You're likely to see the seal doing one of two things, either swimming along, really making progress through the water, or eating a fish and bobbing on the surface. So let's have a look at swimming along. Swimming along is like a dolphin type movement. It's going up and down, undulating, diving under the water and coming back out. And this is when you're swimming along the surface. And you will also see it breathes out through his nose, the splashes coming out the front as he breathes out into the water and, and leaving these big waves as well. Now it's probably quite rare to see him swimming on the surface like this, but when he dives down, these big waves are still there and you can actually use these waves to follow the progress under the water and then guess and follow it so you can see it again when it pops up in a different place. And now let's have a look at him eating a fish. Once it is on the surface, once it's caught a fish, it will actually spend a lot of time bobbing up and down eating this fish that it's caught and you will see these concentric rings a fairly large disturbance in the water and more importantly you will see these circling gulls so whenever you see gulls circling about like this you're very likely to have you know they will have spotted it before you it's worth having a second look it's worth having a go and seeing if you can spot the seal and if that's what they found this time and it's also a best way to actually spot it from a longer distance away so what have you learned? Well, firstly, keep your eyes on the water. Look out for any large disturbances. It could very well be that seal. Look out for these wave patterns. Even if it's dive down, you will be able to follow it and see where it might pop up again. And finally, the circling gulls. That's a real telltale sign. You'll be able to see it from a distance and they will have spotted it long before you have. So happy seal spotting and good luck out there. And I leave you with this clip, probably my favorite clip of the seal. He can't wait for the weir to open in Richmond and is actually making his way, hopping along where the rollers are, where you would take your kayak or rowing boat down and makes his way across to go back down into the basin on the other side. Enjoy.